Okay, we're ready to put on the rails now. We're going to be putting on the rails on this side and the, on the opposite side. We're using um, Simpson Strong Ties, and we're going to be using two of them because they're really, really thin. They have, the thi they have thick um, ties and they have thin ties, and this, these are the thin ones. And these are the only ones I could find in this length. Um, and it, work, it works perfectly well. Uh, the, the type of Simpson, Simpson Strong Tie we're using is an ER-102. When you're putting it on, make sure that you can read it um, in this fashion. And on the right-hand side, it is the, the um, information is on top, and it's read um, in this direction. So make sure you align it like that, because it is somewhat difficult to uh, find the, the right position um, and the right orientation, because these holes they look like they're they're symmetrical, but they're actually not. Um, and if you and you can you can twist it in, in two different ways and or flip it in two different ways, and it, and it just doesn't look. Um, the holes will not line up. So make sure you have it in this orientation uh, when you're putting it on. And we're also using number eight screws because we use the number eight um, nut inserts, and they must be three quarters of an inch in length. If you use longer ones, then it's going to go into the next board, which uh, will not will not allow these to tighten properly. So we're going to go ahead and start um, putting them in, and I'm just going to finger tighten them in here initially. Try to get them at a, a good spacing. Um, not all of the holes are used, and we want to make sure that we get most of them in. Don't tighten them all the way yet get them started and then once you know that each one has a good good contact and starting in each nut insert you can tighten them all down and remember this one is the this one is the one that's going to be rigid it's not going to move at all some of them may be difficult because it could be strained a little bit and that's why we don't screw them down all the way yet Okay, now it's okay to to tighten them. Okay, that is rock solid. Now we can go and do the other side. On the on this side of the um of the machine where, the, where we're using this rail, the adjustable rail, you can see that there are these ovals um, cut out or sort of grooves. Um, a number eight screw is going to be too small so we have to use a spacer. And a spacer is going to allow it a little bit of flexibility. This is only to allow the rail to, to, to get parallel with this rail. And um, to get it tightened um, against the rail, we'll, we're going to, have to use the technique of, of screwing the um, V-groove bearings against the rail. So let's go ahead and start inserting these. This, these rails are actually a mirror image of the rails on the other side. So essentially you're taking the, um, the position of the rails as if you had them here and you're going to flip them to go on the other side. And you'll also see some information where um, it looks like it's the same information on the, on the other side of the tie, but it's not. You'll see that the ER-102 um, is on the bottom portion of this. So don't let that confuse you when, when you um, are establishing the orientation for the rails. So we're going to start by aligning it where it should be, um, getting it close to where the holes are, and we're going to start it with number eight screws that are one and a half inch in length. So go ahead and just start putting them in all the way along. Um, we're going to follow up with putting in a, um, a spacer underneath, a washer, then a nut. You'll need 10 of these. These are the one and a half inch uh, screws. You'll need 10 of the spacers, 10 of the washers, and 10 of the nuts. And all, as always, don't um, tighten them up too tight initially so it can be, it can be um, properly aligned. So for right now, just finger tighten them. Okay. 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 Okay.
the card is not the inside is beautiful. The card is really nice, but the main card is expensive, but it sucks. If you don't do the exact portion, it's closer, it's harder. Actually, I'm going to take it. 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 Yeah. 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 Yeah.